What was it that drew you to this project to begin with? One, Snoop. I've known Snoop for a really long time. Um, I actually worked with him on my first job uh, on One Life to Live. But also, too, I thought the script was really good and really fun. I love Charles Stone, who's the director. He did Drumline and so many other things. And I love working with kids, to be honest. I think it's like something that's um, kind of like, it's, it's weird. It's like an irreverent, wholesome movie, if you take the cursing, but also like, the, the mentorship part of it and coming back home and all that stuff. So I just thought it had all the ingredients of something that would be fun uh, to watch, you know, with myself and when my kid gets maybe a little older. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. And speaking of the kids, you know, you have a really great dynamic with them throughout the movie. So what was it like working with all these like up and coming stars? I loved it. I love working with kids, to be honest. Um, they infuse just like this energy, this youthful, energetic energy. And so they were fun to work with. They were fun to talk to. They were excited to be there. And it just reminded me why I love doing what I, I do. It's like we get to play make-believe all the time. And so <laughs> it was fun to do it with them. Oh, yeah, I imagine. And you mentioned you'd worked with uh, Snoop before. So you have some really nice moments with him in the movie. So I imagine that chemistry was already there. There was no need to work on that or would it have been a while? Well, I think, you know, we were, it was a long time ago and it was, he came in as a guest star, as a musician, like he is, you know, like a rapper. But this time it was just like, we were able to work on our scenes together. We ran the lines together. We talked with each other off, off camera, on camera. Um, we just had a really good, because we joked around so much and we just had a good camaraderie. Like it just all felt it, it was thrown on the screen and you saw that energy. Like I when I watched it, I was like, ooh, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. And you know, I really like the message at the end of of winning not necessarily being the end all be all. Uh what were your first thoughts when you first read that? I liked it. It wasn't the cookie cutter, you know, ending, right? The thing that we all think is gonna happen. Cause that's just not life sometimes. Sometimes even when you do work that hard, it doesn't always end how you want it, but you're still a better person for it no matter what. And then you do what? You move forward and do the next thing. So I love how I love how it ended. 100%. And my last question is with the movie coming out, uh, do you have a personal favorite scene you can't wait for everybody to see? I think every scene I can't wait for everybody to see. <laughs> <laughs> I, want, I want them to see the every scene that we shot, literally. Thank <laughs> you.